G'day mobile gaming fans, it's Michael Raw from Raw Raps here yet again with another game review, another indie game review. I'm getting loads of requests from indie game developers to review their games and I've got to tell you, I love it. They're uh, always a little bit unique, a little bit different and I uh, love doing these reviews. Remember kids, a quick game is a good game so get out into nature and limit your screen time. And uh, don't forget to check out my Gamer Core t shirts on Teespring. Color refraction, reflection. I'm tongue tied today. It's been a long day. And uh, this one, look, I've got to tell you, this is. It spun me out a little bit. It's, it's a pretty unique game. Let's just jump straight in. Red, blue, green gameplay. And you have to. You tap on the screen. And then you move your character. Actually, I've just unlocked someone. He's a new character. I've been playing this a little bit just to try to figure it out because it's just it's spun me out this game. I still haven't really figured out exactly what's going on. Um, you, you tap and then you have to navigate down to the traps or down to the rooms. However, that room in particular, I still haven't figured out why I'm getting out. I, I really don't because there should be traps. There should be spikes and bombs and all sorts of things anyway red green blue you've got to try to get down as far as you can and see I don't know what happened there what? I don't get it maybe I, I, I don't know maybe it's just me <laughs> but if people please download this game and I would love some comments on really what what, what the hell's going on in this game because Okay, so I get to here, and I've got to, I tap, right, and then I'm down further. Okay, so let's move across. I can tap again. Or maybe you have to remember, you might have to remember what the pattern is on the red, green, and blue platforms. So you can navigate down, okay, let's have a look. So. Maybe you got to use your memory. Let's have a look. So I'm going to tap. Let's go down. And there was a gap here, about here somewhere. Oh, no. Oh, that's a shocker. So one thing I will say that on the actual, the Android store, it said that it was a, uh, what was it? Arcade game. So, but actually in the description, it says it's a casual game. And I'd probably, I'd probably agree with it that it's a bit of a casual game. So maybe they've uh, signed up for the wrong category. So, yeah, definitely a casual gameplay, not... Well, you could argue that it's arcade, but it's, I mean, it's level-based. I don't know. Yeah, please comment. Is it is it arcade or casual? I, I, I would probably argue that it's a casual gameplay. Anyway, yeah, let's keep going. See, I'm stuck. Am I? No, hang on. No, I'm not. Let's have a look. Now I'm down again. Now I'm going down. Uh, now, I should have remembered where I was going here. There we go. Now that's red. Let's have a look. So let's remember, there's red. There's a gap on the right-hand side. So let's just... So if I go down... Uh, what was over here? I don't know. Oh, here we go. Now we're going down. So my score's now 224, and the time is increasing. So you have to maybe beat your time. But then how do you score? Maybe when you drop through, let's have a look. Oh yeah, so you score, what was that for? 12 points, is it? Was that 12 points when you go down? Let's have a look. Was it this side? I don't know. It's psyching me out this game. Seem to be going all right now. Oh, let's have a look. Oh, here we go. Now, everyone, remember, green in the middle. There's a gap. No, yes. But then there's three. Oh, and I'm out. See, I don't know why I got out there. Please comment. Please tell me what is going on. So maybe the developer can uh, fill me in. But um, yeah, still haven't entirely figured out this game I think it probably has a lot of merit um, 
Maybe some more testing. Maybe some... Yeah, see, I don't know. I don't get it. I actually don't mind the graphics. I think, you know, it's pretty simple. Uh, very sort of primal graphics with the, uh, you know, the primary colours. You do have unlockables in, in the game. Now, there were supposed to be enemies, and I haven't seen any of those, so I don't know if that's a glitch. But maybe there's supposed to be spikes and things like that. Um, so maybe that maybe there's a glitch in my game. I don't know. But um, again, please comment if you know what's happening to me here. Because I seem to be getting out for no reason. See what happened there? What was wrong with that? Tell me. Tell me what was wrong with that. Anyway, uh, let's just quit out of here. So, oh no, let's not quit. So, as you can see, very very basic gameplay. Uh, well, actually, not basic gameplay, but basic game um, user interface and um, menus, etc. I don't really know how to. So, check in second chance pub vid. So you can actually. Oh, you can view a video. So that's that's the uh, that's their monetization. So you can pause, and the in-app currency must be the score. And then, as you get a higher score, you can unlock different characters. So yeah. Um, look, I th honestly think this game needs a bit more thought. I think that the menus need more thought. The whole design of the game needs more thought. Probably the game hook um, is okay, but again, it's not really clear to the user, so it doesn't really grab me in. It sort of confused me. To, I've got to be honest with you. It's probably a really brilliant, amazing <laughs> game hook, but maybe it's just me and I just don't get it. Um, I, I'm intrigued and I'm dumbfounded and I actually I want to play it more just to figure out what is going on. But this is probably the the... The, the only game I've ever reviewed that has really per perplexed me and uh, made me wonder what is going on. I've, I've figured out most of the other games. Well, I've figured out all the games, really. You want to have a game hook that is immediately engaging and you understand what's going on. You understand what you have to do as a player to progress through the game. Um, and then it's up to the developer to actually design a game that either has a really cha a good challenge to it uh, which isn't too difficult, but is difficult enough to keep you wanting more. So, probably misses on a lot of these marks. I actually, again, I really want to see what, what the concept is behind this game. So, yeah. Um, maybe it's just today that I just can't understand what's going on. But I've actually played this quite a few times. And I feel like I'm missing something. Anyway. Uh, again, there's no sound in this game, so maybe a bit of sound might be nice. Um, yeah, needs more work, but definitely intriguing, and I'd love to see version uh, 1.1 or 1.2 or 2.0. Anyway, uh, remember kids, a quick game's a good game. Don't forget to check out my other videos. Please subscribe to this channel. I'm going to be doing a lot of indie game reviews uh, in the next few days to weeks, because I'm getting a lot of requests. Um, which I love. I think it's fantastic. Love doing them and I think it's... Uh, I love reviewing these games because they're sort of an unknown quantity and uh, yeah, I can be one of the first people to review them so I feel very privileged to do it. Anyway, uh, remember to keep watching and uh, stay tuned for the next video. Thank you.